I think her childhood was not good. And yes, you're right. My childhood was not good. I've experienced a lot of violence in my life. I've experienced a lot of toxicity from my neighborhood. I've experienced a lot of people bullying me. I've experienced a lot of drama. I've experienced a lot of pain and suffering. I've experienced a lot of trauma. I've experienced someone physically assaulting me. I've experienced a lot of abuse. I've experienced a lot of death in my life. Yes, I died many times. And all those traumas I've experienced in my life, because of that, it made me the person I am right now. I chose to better myself rather than victimizing myself. Well, I used to victimize myself because it felt good. I used to feel sorry for myself. Oh, poor me, poor me. Because of my past, of my childhood, I become like this. So I don't care if I'm bad because I'm a victim. Why not? So I can get away with it. Hey, I'm a victim, right? But I was never happy in life. I was miserable. I feel like I was depressed. I feel like I just want to end my life. Then one day a voice came to my head. I think it was my angel. And the angel told me, Halga, what are you doing? I was like, what am I doing? What do you mean? And the voice was like, what are you doing to yourself? I was like, well, I'm a victim. I, I should pity myself. I should get away from everything because, you know, I had a lot of trauma. I'm a victim, you know? And the voice was like, yeah, I know you are feeling sorry for yourself. But how far can you go with this kind of self-pity? Are you going to do this for the rest of your life? And then I said, yes, I'm going to do this for the rest of my life because I'm so mad that people were so mean to me. People were, were doing bad things to me and it's not fair. I'm a good person. Why did they do to me? And the voice was like, well, do you really want to feel like you want to be angry for the rest of your life? And I said, not really because I don't like it. And then the voice said, okay, then I will show you the way. And I was like, okay, can you show me the way? How can I do this? How can I do that? So basically, the angel was guiding me of how to change my life, how to go to the path where I am right now. So basically, it's all about decision making because I was told by my angel, if you don't stop pitying yourself, you're never going to go far in life. You're, you're always going to experience a lot of bad things in your life because if your mind is toxic and negative, whatever is happening, whatever things that will come into your life, it's always going to be a negative because you are manifesting it. But if you want to change your mind, change the way you look at things and the way you look at things will change. I was like, wait a minute. Yeah, you're right. You're right about that. I have to change my mind. I have to change how I think if I want to see a different things in my life. So that's when I changed my life. I had to go through a lot of suffering and pain and emotional experience because it was a lot of challenge to change who I am because before I was just a totally different person. I just feel like I just have no hope for humanity. But now I, I felt so much love. I feel like I want to make a difference in the world and that includes don't give a feck about what people think of me and whatever happened to me from my past all the trauma that I've experienced I actually thank them I thank all the pain and suffering that came to my life because I wouldn't be the person I am right now because of without without the suffering that I've experienced in my life so yes I had a very bad childhood but I am glad that I had a bad childhood. Okay, so now you know. Thank you. Mwah.